Hey, did you know that there are dogs at the farm show as well? Well, an important part of the Department of Agriculture is the licensing of dogs in the Commonwealth and also looking at kennels and how dogs are raised and bred. And I'm here with uh, Megan Horse. Megan is the dog warden actually for Berks County. Yes. We're part of Region 7. Megan, thank you and yes. Lacey yes, for welcome. letting us talk with you and pet Lacey a little bit. <laughs> I'll get down there and get that soon. Megan, tell me a little bit about why we have to get a dog license and you know what are the deadlines for it? Okay, so annual licenses are due um, January 1st of every year um, and that's good till December 31st uh, of that year. And then there's oh, also- a deadline then. Yes, there's also the um, lifetime license which is good for the life of the dog. Um, and then the licenses actually- Come back, Lacey. Yeah. <laughs> And the licenses actually are what fund our department. So we are in charge of, you know, like you said, kennels, um, dog bites, stray dogs. So it's important to get your dog license to help fund what we do to help you. Um, and then also if your dog would happen to get loose, that's how we get it back to you. Um, and everybody says their dog is not going to get loose, but it does, it does happen, happen on rare occasions. So. Right, exactly. So where do you go to get your dog license at? Um, you, you would go to the Berks County Treasurer's Office okay. um, and they can, they can provide you with the dog license application um, and the lifetime license application as well there. All right, that's okay. good to know, good information. Now, you know, animal welfare is very important to my constituents and awful, very many members of, of the Commonwealth. Yes. In terms of breeding dogs, what's Pennsylvania doing to make sure that the animals that we like to call our pets, whether they're at shelters or whether yeah. we find them in pet stores, are well cared for and healthy? Um, so we do, we have um, breeders that have kennel licenses. Um, that's for anybody that has 26 or more dogs in a calendar year. Um, and they are required to be inspected at least twice a year. Okay. And we're looking at the conditions they're living in as well as the conditions of the dogs. Um, and then we also have uh, a tip line that we use for anybody that's concerned about dogs that maybe aren't meeting the kennel requirements, right. but are still concerned about the welfare of the dogs. So they can always use that tip line. Um, it's on our website. What, do, you, do you happen to know what that yeah, number it's, is? It's www.agriculture.pa.gov. Okay. And that's, there's Maybe a, we can put that up on our screen. Yeah, you can submit it right online and then it comes to us. Very good. It's mm -hmm. good to know. Yeah. So tell me a little bit about this lovely lady down here. Uh, this is my old girl, Lacey. She's almost 10 years old. Um, I adopted her when I first got into the job. And she comes to Farm Show every year to get some love and attention and talk to people about dog licensing. Well, she's doing a very good job. She's a great ambassador for um, making sure that we get a license. I think Lacey is taking a break. She found a so, treat, I think. She found a treat, okay. So Lacey likes Farm Show food too. Yes, yeah. Warden Horse, thank you so much for your time no talking problem. with us about this. I mean, it's an important issue and it's a part of the Department of Agriculture. Yes. So it's appropriate let it be here at Farm Show. Yes. So thank you so much. Thank you. You bet.